Hello, my name is Alexi Bushino. I'm the Communications and Development Director at St. Fortius Orthodox Theological Seminary. I'm here to share an update about the Shelley wildfire. Uh, this is an ongoing situation. You can actually hear the helicopters. Glory be to God. Uh, Aetna is safe. The seminary is safe. The fire started uh, the 3rd of July and over the past almost two weeks has continued to grow. Um, it's at 15,000 acres in size. It started off in the Klamath National Forest in the wilderness area, very rugged terrain. Um, and, and the weather had been un unusually hot and dry, uh, which really provided the conditions for a massive fire. There was significant fire activity and growth over the weekend on Saturday. Uh, the fire, I guess, jumped one of the control lines due to high winds and, and came within about two miles of the city of Etna. It, it was quite a frightening uh, situation. And on Monday, um, truly a miracle. There was no forecast uh, weather systems for any type of rain. But uh, by God's grace, uh, there, there was rain in some places, a significant amount of rain, uh, and that allowed the firefighters to, to sort of secure a perimeter, um, and, and it was contained to where they could start actually put, working on putting the fire out. Glory be to God, earlier today, uh, the evacuation warning for the convent of St. Elizabeth the Grand Duchess was lifted. Thank God the, the monastery of St. Gregory of Palamas is, is also safe. Um, you know, the monastics are well. The mandatory evacuation order for the neighborhood, which includes the parish of St. Cyprian and Justina, has been downgraded to a warning. Uh, so that's, that's a significant step in the right direction. Thank God, through the tireless efforts of the firefighters, there's over 3,000 personnel here on site. Um, everything from helicopters, uh, you know, hundreds of fire engines, bulldozers to help the hand crews with building containment lines and fire control lines, uh, water trucks. Uh, the effort has been nonstop. Uh, glory be to God, there have uh, been no structures lost. We're so grateful for all the firefighters, for the law enforcement that have helped uh, maintain order, and we're thankful for your prayers. Uh, please continue to pray for the firefighters, for all those that are assisting in this effort. Uh, continue to pray for calm weather, low winds, um, you know, cloud cover. Again, this all helps create those favorable weather conditions that will allow the, the, the fire to be stopped. Thank you.